Okay guys, a quick update. Uh, pull cord. I did the pull cord. I did the cup. Um, the cup was identical to the one I pulled off except it was solid on the bottom which was good. The hole was one size bigger. And I didn't want to play any games with it wanted to walk. So I put a bead around it, ground the flush and went in there with a the unit bit. Put that on there mint it spins nice and uh, even put the pull cord on thing fires right up I will be truthful with you I am not happy with this cord I think this cord is too narrow this was number four cord eighth of an inch um, I only bought seven feet of it I turned around I bought a hundred foot roll of number six cord which is three sixteenths which should match kind of like the factory cord then I'm not going to worry about it. The, the two-stroke ones, when you pull on it, it puts some resistance back on the cord. I don't want to have to deal with it. So the machine's up going, cover's on, not screwed on, but it's still sitting at work. Um, that should be here soon. We've got carburetor parts coming for this thing soon. Okay. And... Ta-da! Look at this thing. Yard machine, single stage snowblower, 21 inch, four cycle. Pretty clean unit. <laughs> no surface rust, no nothing. Thing starts up on one pull. Junior just found this in the trash. So, he calls me up, tells me he found it. He goes, Dad, before I put it in the car, he goes, I pulled the cord, I had compression. He goes, I threw it in the car, I took a chance. And he calls me a little while later, he goes, Dad. He goes, I looked at it, it has fresh gas in it. Okay. Pulled it a bunch of times, would not start. He goes, I pulled the spark plug out, checked it for spark, and there was no spark across the plug. And he goes, I just took a chance. He goes, I... I had other plugs that goes. I know we found plugs all the time on the racing mini bike. He screwed a plug in there, one pull, up and going. So the actual plug was bad. It wasn't fouled, it was bad. I don't know where he, where it is because I know he didn't do it in here. He did it in the shed. So uh it's a nice little unit and it's four cycle. So obviously it runs quiet, uh, idles a little nicer and it's a little smoother. So and most of it's metal. As you can see, with just like a plastic cover on it, as opposed to that one I just potted out, uh, it was all plastic. So it's definitely not the top of the line. Junior's looking it up now to see what you know what size engine. Well, it says on here, 123 cc. Um, I got a feeling it's going to be somewhere in like the three horse zone, but it is a lean back motor with an overhead valve engine on it carburet is super easy to get to I like that <laughs> definitely no covers back here uh, gas tanks nice and simple it's right there um, and that's it you get your normal jets here your jet and your drain and then you got your idle jet up higher primer bulb I mean the aluminum's not even oxidized on the engine yet so uh, he's gonna look it up. Maybe we can figure out how old it is. It can't be more than a couple years old. So either this thing laid through the winter and it didn't fire up, and the guy gave up, or maybe it's you know one or two years old. Either or, does not matter. Does not matter. So I got rid of one snowblower to make room, and we landed another one. So we'll see how it does. Got nothing to lose, right? Nothing to lose. Definitely manual. <laughs> it's as manual as it gets. But that's better than a shovel. So. Okay, guys. Just wanted to bring you up to speed on what's going on. Uh, so, this is up and going. The one at work is technically up and going, but I'm going to switch the cord on it. Cord's easy to switch now that it's all assembled. You just spin it, we're going to slip the new cord in, tie the knot, and we're done. 
Uh, this one should be some carburetor stuff and we should be done with it. Uh, and we'll test this thing out, see how it does. And the other one is just sitting in the storage unit now in front of my car sideways. Uh, I'll probably go there this weekend to fire it up make sure everything's good. Because we didn't use it last year, so that makes me nervous. So, so that's about it, guys. Okay, I'm out of here.